You are now watching James the New King. to the channel guys and today we are playing pet simulator x but we are also going to be talking about an awesome fusing method actually one of the best fusing methods to get one of the rarest pets in the game and this pet that we are going to be using this fusing method to get is actually super awesome so you guys should watch to the end of this video to find out how to get this amazing pet and fuse it for your pet collection and for your inventory because this pet is actually awesome guys and i'm going to show you guys what pet we are talking about right now but before we actually talk about this pet make sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already hit that like button and don't forget to share this video when it is over so other people know how to get this amazing pet and how to fuse this very rare pet so the fusing method that we're using today is super easy guys. It actually uses some very common pets to get a super rare pet. And it is actually a pretty cool fusing method because it only takes three pets to make this amazing rare pet. Now, usually a fusing method can take some rainbow pets, some expensive pets, or just a bunch of pets, but today's fusing method I'm going to be showing you guys today only takes three regular pets. They don't have to be rainbows, and they're only three common pets that are actually pretty easy to get to get a super rare awesome pet. So let's go over to the Christmas update. All right, guys, we are heading to the Christmas update. All right, we're here, and... If you guys look over here, this is the best egg in the game, and these are some of the best pets in the game right now, but these are not the pets that we are going to be fusing. We are actually going to be fusing one of the pets from this egg. If you guys look right here, there are a bunch of really common pets, but there's a pet right here with two question marks, and what's really crazy, guys, is that the best egg in the Christmas event has a bunch of pets with two question marks and I've hatched basically all of them, but I've never hatched this pet. It's actually pretty difficult to hatch, but I'm going to show you guys how to fuse it and it is actually pretty easy to get this pet from fusing. And if you guys don't know what pet this is, this is the candy cane pet. It's a super cool pet. It's the best pet out of this egg basically. All right, so let's head over to the beach where you actually fuse pets. Now this is where we're going to fuse these pets because obviously the fusing machine is here. Now there's also a fusing machine in the trading plaza as well, so you can use either one of these machines, but I am using the one here in the starter area of Pet Simulator X. Now let's head over here. All right guys, so first I am going to unequip all of my pets and show you guys which pet we are going to be fusing today. It's actually a very cool pet, and you will get a rainbow from these common pets. So this is it, guys, and you will get a rainbow uh, candy cane pet when you fuse these very common regular pets. Now, this pet is amazing. It actually looks very cool. Check it out, guys. It is a rainbow. It's obviously a candy cane pet, and we are going to be fusing for this pet today. Now, this fusing method that I'm showing you guys today does not work every single time, but it works a lot of the time, and these are very common pets, so you can try over and over again. As you can see, I have five Rudolph pets, so I have enough to actually try this method a bunch of times. So we're going to use one Rudolph. Does not have to be a golden or rainbow, just a regular Rudolph, a regular jelly alien, and a regular... Um, festive dog. These are all very common, easy pets that you guys can get very easy. And I will show you guys where each one of these pets come from and what egg they actually come from. All right, so I selected a festive dog, a jelly alien, and a Rudolph. Now let's fuse. All right, so I did not get anything. I didn't get the candy cane. I actually got this pet right here. Let's try it again, guys. And we're going to get a Rudolph, a jelly alien, and a festive dog. Let's try it again. Okay, it didn't work again. I got a golden jelly alien. <laughs> okay, let's try it again. A festive dog, a jelly alien, 
and a Rudolph. Okay, come on. Oh, it didn't work again. All right, let's try one more time. Okay, Rudolph, Jelly Alien, and a Festive Dog. The good thing about this, guys, is... Okay, I didn't get it again. The good thing about this method is that it takes some really common pets, so you really can just um, fuse these pets for a while because they're actually pretty cheap, pretty easy pets. And look, guys, I actually got a candy cane. <laughs> I got a candy cane pet. All right, so this is actually pretty cool. Um, it did take five tries. I got four other pets, and they are goldens. But I actually got a rainbow candy cane pet right here, guys. They are actually pretty rare, and now I have a bunch of them. Let's see here. Okay, where are my pets? Okay, so here's the candy canes. And now I have two rainbow candy canes. I also have one in the dark matter machine, guys. So I will make a video letting you guys know how powerful a dark matter candy cane pet is. But as you can see, these are not the best pets. They're not the strongest pets in this game, but they're just very cool pets. And you do want to get these for your inventory. So you have them and you unlock that pet in your inventory and you do want to get these pets even if you don't keep them or collect them because when you go over this machine it will say that you have it unlocked and as you can see I have 549 pets unlocked 61% of all the pets so I don't even have all of the pets unlocked but it will be in your pet collection so now you'll have it unlocked even if you get rid of this pet and I have the rainbow legendary candy cane right here unlocked in my inventory I do still have to get the regular legendary candy cane and the golden and obviously the dark matter legendary candy cane but these are awesome pets, guys. You can get these very rare pets in this fusing method that I showed you today. All right, now I'm going to show you the location of each egg for all three pets you need to do this fusing method. So I'm going to show you guys where each pet is and what egg you actually need to purchase from. Now, one of the three pets that you need to fuse to get these candy cane rainbows is in this egg. Now, you need a festive dog. And the festive dog is right here. It is a 49% chance of getting it. It's actually super easy to get this pet. And the next pet is in the tech shop. It is in these planet eggs and you do need a jelly alien. These are the easiest pets to get. They are the most common and they are only 94% chance of getting them. So you can get them very easily. And the third pet that you need to do this fusing method is in this egg, which is the egg of many gifts. It's the best egg in the Christmas update. And here it is right here. It does have two question marks next to it, but it is really easy to get. It's a legendary as well, I believe. And it's not very hard to purchase this pet. Um, if we just sit here and purchase just a couple times, we'll get a Rudolph pet uh, pretty quickly. And here it is, Legendary Rudolph. Um, it's really easy to get these Rudolph pets. And that is the third pet that you need in this fusing method. And it is right here, guys. So that is how you get the Rainbow Candy Cane Legendary Pets. They're very rare and very awesome, guys. There they are right there. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for making it this far if you haven't already. Please do not forget to like, subscribe, and don't forget to share this video, guys. Let everybody know how to get these awesome, very rare, legendary rainbow pets. And I will see you guys on the next video.